I'm Hussam Noor from Mohammed bin, bin, bin Salman Cardiac Center. I join with my colleague, uh, Dr. Sadananda. The purpose of this short video is to show you how you deploy um, uh, coronary coil in case of perforations. The equipment that you need for coronary uh, coiling in cases of perforation, especially for epicardial or even septal perforations, you need a microcatheter. The usual one is 014. It's an example of which is fine cross, but you can use the uh, the Corsair, you can use even the turnpike. Turnpike. Anything 0.014. Yep. Then you have to get the specific coils. Uh, this is in this example we have the axiom coils, and you can see the sizes here, which is this is the the diameter of, of the vessel should be like uh, if the if the if the collateral is about two millimeters or less, you can use a two millimeter coil, and there is the length of it. Uh, so this is the coil that we'll be using. And the third component of this is the detacher. So, you have a perforation, you have a microcatheter in, in situ. The purpose is to deliver this coil into the distal perforated vessel, and this would be used to detach the coil when you're happy with the position. Okay. Correct. So, we flush the microcatheter. This is flushed. Flash. Okay. Okay. So my half is flashed. So okay. everything is. Now let's make sure that we stop it. Right? Yeah. So that's how it comes. Huh? Yeah. Can you show? Uh, go down here. Put it down here. This is how it comes exactly. Yeah. And like yeah. anything else, you flush. You flush it with the uh, upper nice saline. And see, show, show it slowly so that you can see when it comes out. Slowly, 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 slowly. The hypo -tube. All right? This is the hypo -tube. Yeah, slowly so it would not be. Okay. Yeah. I just want to show you. So there is a tube. I don't know. Do you see it? Yeah. Yeah. You need to zoom down all the zoom way down, down, all the way down. And you can see the yeah. pile here. So there's a hypo tube plastic tube sheath covering and there's a coil down there and on this side this is the junction of the hypo tube and the wire with which you are going to push the coil into the micro catheter uh, right now I'm going to put the uh, tip of the hypo tube into the hub of the micro catheter so I am holding it and I am gently pushing the coil as you can see, the coil is going inside. The hyper tube is in the inlet of the, the fine cross microcatheter, and I'll ask my colleague Sadananda to just to push it with the. And now we're pushing the coil gently, and we keep pushing. Yeah. Keep pushing. And keep pushing, pushing, keep pushing. Now you can pull out the hyper tube. Yeah. Keep pushing. Then, yeah. Uh, no, I, then okay. you can push. Show here. Stop. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see how now, can I Yeah. You're controlling now, that. Now, white has gone all the way in. Yeah. All the way in. Okay. Now, pull the Now, tube. this is very important steps. Now, the wire has gone all the way in into the hyper tube. So, while holding the microcatheter in position, I'm going to pull out the hyper tube till I see the wire, which is right there. Yeah. You see that? I'm going to pull the hyper tube out. All the way out. You can, you can loop it. Stop. So the hyper tube has been removed. I'm keep on pushing on the hard end of the wire till the, we deliver the coil at the location that we want. You can zoom there all the way down. You see the coil will come out soon here is gonna come it's gonna come so as I'm gonna push it you can see that's it the coil right it has not been deployed the beauty of this one I can if I'm not happy with the position I can pull it back 
as you see that I pulled it all the way back into the hypertube sheath. I was, I was, and you can see, see it there. Eh? So pull back again. And now I reposition my microcatheter, the place that I like, then I push it back again. Fantastic. Yeah. So, so then this comes with an instant detacher. There is an arrow marking where to. Up. I think you would push it to the black line. There's a black line here. Yeah, the plate there. Yeah. It's clear uh, steel with a serration here at the Proximal really end. Proximal end, yeah. And this black one, black again, there is a knee, uh, there is a thread inside a tube. What it does is you hook it inside this. Once you feel resistance. Once you feel resistance, do that's it. And we deploy the detaches the cord, yeah. right? Yes. Okay. Pull the catch back. And that's it. See? Now you see it has pulled. Yeah. So the coil has been released and then case is finished. So dear colleagues and friends, uh, Sadran and I uh, from Mohammed bin uh, Khalifa bin Salman Cardiac Center wanted to demonstrate to you how to deploy the Axiom uh, uh, coronary uh, coils. It's very simple but also very important to know how to do it is because it's a potentially life threatening situation that you have in which you can use these coils to uh, seal the perforation. Thank you for watching. Till the next video.